I'm Mr. Dredla, and we're going to use diamond boxes as a tool for solving the quadrat quadratic equations. Two numbers, when added together, will give us a product that goes in the top box, and when added together, will give us a sum which goes in the bottom box. We'll start with the numbers 3 and 4. Multiply them together, we'll get the number 12. When we add them together, we get the number 7. Okay, let's do another one. Two numbers, negative 3 and 8. Multiply them together, we get negative 24. Add them together, and we get 5. Okay, now we're going to find the factor that when multiplied times 9 gives us 27. Then we'll add it and sum it to give us the sum. 3 times 9 is 27. 9 and 3 are 12. This time we're going to deal with the integers negative 4 and 9. So again, this is the product and this is the sum. And we're going to deal with the negative sign first. So we'll have a negative in there. 4 times 9, 36. 9 minus 4, 5. This time we need to find the integer when multiplied times 5 that gives us negative 15. So I'm going to deal with the negative sign first. 5 times negative 3 is 15. 5 minus 3 is 2. This time we're going to find two integers that when multiplied together give us negative 36, but when added together give us 16. We'll start by factoring negative 36. We'll write the factors. Um, 18 and 2, um, 12 and 3, 9 and 4. I'm going to write them twice because I'm going to distribute this negative sign first to the first factor and second time to the second factor so that we can find a sum. So first time goes to the first factor, second time to the second factor. We'll start with negative 18 and 2. The sum of negative 18 and 2 is negative 16. That's not what we need. The sum of negative 12 and 3 are negative 9. That's not right. 4 minus 9 is negative 5. 18 minus 2 neg is 16. Those are our factors. 18 and negative 2. Okay. We're going to use our diamond problems to factor the equation x squared plus 6x plus 8. We'll find two factors that when added equal 6, but when multiplied, equal 8. Start by factoring the product. The product is either 8 times 1 or 2 times 4. We see that 2 and 4, when added together, equals 6. So we can put 2 and 4. That means our factors are x plus 2 times x plus 4. Those are our factors. That equals x squared plus 2x plus 4x plus 2 times 4, 8. Reduce plus 6x plus 8. Salt.